All right. You guess what time it is. It's time for the latest Ace 3 VR update. Just ignore those guns. I will talk about them in a minute. But first of all, we got some new guns this week. A lot of classics. Uh, hopefully I can pronounce some of these names because, uh, man, some of these, uh, some of these, uh, European stuff, you know, sometimes I don't get right, but, uh, I know Anton has shown off the, uh, different guns here, but we're just going to take a look at them ourselves because they are pretty nice. Look at that. How do you, uh, hmm, I need to put a magazine in there. Maybe let's put a magazine in. All right. There is a safety, I think, right? If you press up on the uh, touchpad, that little safety goes up, up and down, up and down. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that was on safe. You can see it doesn't really fire, but I put the safety down. Oh, what am I doing? Shooting at the wall. That doesn't make any sense. Let me, uh, we do three meters here. Not too far. And, uh. Ooh, yeah, this thing shoots a little high. You gotta aim down a little bit. But this is the C93 Borchart. Borch Borchart? Borchart? <laughs> Again, these names are really uh, hard for me to pronounce. I mean, you know, just because I am pretty not, not smart. <laughs> Uh, to be honest with you, I have, like, for most of these guns, I have no idea, like, the history or... I mean, I've seen this in, like, what, Red Dead Redemption? You know, most of my knowledge comes from video games. But there's some stuff that I read about. But none of these, like, except for the 1911, which we'll get to in a minute, I have no idea, like, you know, about these guns. So uh, you might have to go look up a Forgotten Weapons or something, somebody more uh, educated and book read than me I just you know I play video games and what, what do you expect but it's a pretty good uh, it's a pretty good gun like Anton said I think the later Luger design was kind of based off of this you know yeah so I mean it's got you know obvious design inspirations And it's pretty accurate. Let's do like a fast, you know, just, just from, uh, all right, I'm just going to bring the gun up and see if I can hit the center of the target. Ah, not bad. Not bad. First shot was pretty, uh, terrible. But, uh, yeah. Let's get a good look at it firing from the side. That's pretty cool. I love that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the C93, that's what we'll call it now. Just grab this. It's down there. Of course, we'll get to the 1911 eventually, because we all know what a 1911 is like. But this is the, uh, pack, uh, the, so the Pocket Hammerless 1903. Yes. Or hammer. Sorry, no, no, no. The pocket hammerless is different. But uh, this is the pocket hammer 1903 Colt. Uh, from what I've seen, made this. And it fires 38 ACP. I'm glad I got the right magazine. The, the magazine for this and the 1911 looks similar. And the guns look similar, obviously. But uh, yeah, there's like, you know, does that feel weird? The gun kind of sits farther, right? That's that's pretty, uh... Yeah, see, it moves forward a bit when you grab it. Watch, watch, watch. <laughs> so it's, it sits a little farther, but I guess that's because the gun is so small that grabbing stuff like the... the, uh... the slide would be like... You know, if you grab the slide over here, you know, you, you would pretty much... You know... But, yeah. Over here, there's nothing. But here... I don't know. Maybe that's the reason. Who knows? All I know is that it looks pretty cool. Especially with those, like, what, ivory grips? 
on it. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh man, the sight picture on this thing is just terrible. These tiny little sights. Well, I mean, you know, guns back then were a work in progress, so you you can't blame them for trying. And this one, the slide does not lock back. So you just got to kind of, after every magazine, you just kind of have to pull the slide back. I wonder if this, uh, this will work. It does. If you want to rack the slide using the environment or another gun, just there we go. That's pretty cool. Don't spend too much time on that. But the pocket hammer 1903, and of course, we got the uh, classic M1911. Whoa. Which um, is different from the more modern versions because, well, you know, our Anton already laid that out. But, you know, the classic nineteen pre-war 1911s were pretty, uh, you know, yeah, they look pretty good. And just this, this little, like, damage here on the side. <laughs> oh, the frame there, that's, uh, that's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, it's a 1911. Obviously, the sights uh, are a little hard to read. But we all know what a 1911 is like. Not much has changed. There are some, like, minimal changes that I can't really tell you because uh, I'm not that smart. Somebody with more uh, education can probably tell you that. All I know is that it's pretty much kind of the same. Oh, I forgot there's a slide release. So. <laughs> Got really used to the uh, the uh, pocket hammer over there. But yeah, everyone knows what this is like. So we're not going to dwell too much on that. And then we've got the, uh, oh man, uh, this is going to be tough. The Schrogren, no, no, Schrogren. So, uh, look, I can't pronounce that. I don't know how to pronounce that. I mean, I tried looking it up online, but uh, it was like, you know, yeah, it was all crazy. But uh, this is the uh, inertia, inertial shotgun, right? Uh, made famous by, I think, uh, what, was, what game was that? Hunt? Uh, completely forgot. I never played it, so don't ask me about that game. Uh, yeah, we'll just put one in there. One, two, three, four, five, five, plus one in the chamber. That's six. Let's grab the... Uh, Chop version as well. Let's put that there. Actually, let's load that one too. So, four, five, six. All right. Open this up. One in the chamber. Five in the tube. And uh, let's put that there. Oh, yeah. You know what? Hold on just a second. Let me just clean up all these mags. But yeah, this is a unique shotgun that um, looks really dangerous, but uh, apparently from what I've heard, it's pretty safe. So you shouldn't worry too much about it, but I don't know, man. It just looks so different and unique. It's got a wonderful little action on it. Oh, we turn off the safety first. See that? That's what people are worried about right there. But, you know, the Swedish, they make quality stuff, so you shouldn't have to worry about that. There's a really unique shotgun. I actually, wait, hold on. 
Okay. All right. Cool. There is a um, slide release uh, lever or a uh, button. So you can do that automatically. I think it's up on the touchpad. Just like everything else. And it's a nice little uh, semi-automatic shotgun. No pumping required. That I can definitely get used to. All right, let's try the chop version. Obviously, let's turn it to uh, fire. Same cartridge capacity as well. So one, two, three, four, five, six. want to take a look at it shooting from the side. Oh, that is so nice. I don't know much about it, but uh, from what I've uh, seen today, it's a pretty cool shotgun. <laughs> oh man, that is cool. All right, let's uh, get rid of these. All right, so you might be wondering why I have all this other ammunition here. Well, in the patch notes, it said that Anton uh, added or fixed a couple of things. One thing is that the Model 10 now has a speed loader. So if you guys like your Model 10, which I would like to turn you around. There we go. I think I might need to switch my controllers here. Yeah, I need to switch my controllers. Hold up just one second. Grab that other gun. Trackpad on this one is broken. I need to mark these, by the way. But yeah, so, you know, you want a speed loader? You got one. Let me just clear this. And uh, there we go. <laughs> just launch those bullets out. Those empty cartridge casings. Basically open. Throw it like that. <laughs> no, you're not supposed to do that. That's how you're supposed to do that. Oh, come on. Don't tell me the, the trackpad on this one is breaking too. Oh, no. But yeah, so you get a, uh, instead of, uh, instead of it coming with a single round. Ooh. You get a speed loader. Do this one more time. So that's pretty cool. Let's take that there. Let's close you up. Come on. No, nope. you're not going to do that. There we go. And uh, you see, I've got all these lever actions here. Well, Anton has uh, made it so that the, uh, what is this called? Uh, let me check the patch notes here. This is the W330 scope mount. The old scope. Well, I think that works now on, there we go, on the lever actions as well. I think the uh, scope was originally meant for the, uh, hold on, wait a minute. Uh, was it the Auto 5? No. Or it was the Browning, right? Uh, rifle, rifle, battle rifle? Oh my goodness, I can't remember anymore. Hold on. Just a second. No, it was not an assault. I think it might have been a carbine. The Model 8. There we go. This uh, this was the scope was for the Model 8, but now you can use the scope with the uh, lever actions. I completely forgot what this was. 1894. Oh, yep. Yeah. This one shoots, I think, in, um, oh my goodness. I cannot remember. 94 is uh, 44 Magnum, so. I mean, uh, I should use the scope. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so 
Uh, hold on just a second. Man, I got to get rid of some of the stuff. Oop. Oh, no. Oh, no, I dropped the... Uh... All right, so let's try all these. Oh, mean to do that. Grab all these. All right, so now you get a scope for the 1894. Oh, man. 44. 44 Magnum. Can't do that. Nope. <laughs> Ooh, on just a second. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Let's uh let's make this farther. Let's go to um ten meters. That's a little Yeah, that's fine. Let's uh sight down this uh scope here. Oh, so close. Oh, that was a bullseye. That's a uh, third shot. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> the pains of being left-handed. If you're right-handed, this would be so much more easier. But I am lefty. All right, so that's the 1894, and then you've got all these um, different sizes of the uh, uh, 1873, which should work with the uh, scope as well. Yep. I'm not going to fire these. Maybe. Let me just try it on this one. Ooh, nice. Come on. And, of course, you can also put it on the... Uh, the chopped lever action Winchester, my favorite. Now, if you could put this on the um, the uh, the shotgun, that would be a real trip. I don't know, maybe if you use slugs or something. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> Yeah, I'm um, not really using the scope much, am I? Where did I hit there? Oh, a little high, huh? A little lower. Oh, but yeah, so you can put the scope on now. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I really want to try something, though. I don't think it'll work, but it's, uh... Let's try, uh... No, <laughs> no, it was never going to work. But uh, yeah, so those are the major changes. Uh, there's some stu uh, some stuff in Take and Hold. But uh, all right, maybe I should go to Take and Hold and do a little uh, cow wiener calico. Where am I going? There I am. Okay. Go Take and Hold. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to read the patch notes here. All right. Not much. Just uh, more uh, little tweaks for taking hold. But I should do cow wiener calico. And, um, yeah. All right. Uh, nine vulnerable. Health mode, standard, spawn lock. Everything is... Uh, making me overpowered. Okay, let's go. It's time to take some holds, I guess. <laughs> I can't think of anything good to say while I'm loading here. Just watching this uh, little thing telling me to wait. Oh, all right, man, I really need to get a... <laughs> SSD one of these days.
Oh, there we go. All right, so let's try to get uh, all of the uh, guns that were released today. The C93. Obviously, got to try that out. Oh, um, hmm. What quick belt should I use? Tactical Mark II? Hmm. All right, we'll try that uh, going forward. Let's see. Uh, C93, we got the... Where did you go? It's alphabetical, so P... Element OP, B, B, pocket, pocket, uh, oh man, hold on, <laughs> uh, let's see, hold on, all right, where is the classic 1911, oh man, there are so many guns here, oh uh, my goodness, Sorry, this is taking a little too long. Nope, that's the uh, TT-33. Huh. Um, turns out those guns... Oh, wait, you know, hold on, hold on. Maybe I'm not looking hard enough. No, that's the M1911A1. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Huh. Uger M1912, Makarov Mark 22, Tactical, just be match. Am I not seeing them? Oh, we got the Model 10, so I'm just gonna get that. Let's put that there. Oh, make sure I got a. Uh, and then we've got the, uh, let's see, tube fed. Let's get the shorty. This one has uh, six, right? Two, three, four, five, six. Get rid of those. Okay. No, oh, you know what? Yep. Get over there. That one there. All right. Oh, uh, let's see. Um, <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're not in the item spawner. That is... Or, hold on. 1911. Gold, modern, operator, tactical. Okay. I could have sworn I saw a 1911 somewhere else in here. No. Okay. No pocket, uh, pocket hammer 1903 or classic 1911. Hmm. That is strange. All right, so I've got the shotguns. I got the boar shark. What else do I... Can I use... Um, hmm. Well, you know what? <laughs> Since it's not here, I might as well use the, uh, the 1912. Oh, well, get the machine pistol version. There we go. That's what I want to do. Spawn. Give me this. I don't know if I used this last time. I think I did, but we're just going to do some classic stuff now. All right. Oh, now we're moving really fast. Hold on just a second. Let's go to um, movement modes. Oh, okay. So Anton added, uh, no, wait, no, hold on, hold on. That was all there that, that whole time, okay. So what does sneak sound, okay. Slow. Moderate. Fast. Fast is good. Blazing is just like, wow, dude. Okay, we'll just go with fast for right now. All right. Where's my radar? It's on this hand. 
I'm gonna go and take that. Supply point. Oh, you know what? I didn't try. I didn't try putting uh, suppressors on these guns. I just can't quit you. Over there. Oh, goodness. Gotcha. <laughs> I forgot to turn the safety off on this thing, so. Throw that away. All right. Gonna go to the hold point. Should be over here. Let's check this out. <laughs> nice. Throw those away. <laughs> I can see myself using this uh, this shotgun a lot, but interfacing with system. not pull the... Nope. Oh, I didn't load this thing. Ooh. I got it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, well... Hold on just a second. I need to turn on the lights in my room. It's pretty dark in here. If I can't see my room, then I don't know what's gonna what's gonna happen if I bump into something. All right, let's just use the Model Ten here. Huh? What the? Oh no! I didn't load it. <laughs> I'm making all sorts of errors today. Uh-oh. Got somebody coming up behind me. Nope. And I am getting too close to my wall here. Man. I gotta stop forgetting to turn off the safeties on my guns. Uh, okay, well... Ooh, scared me. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. I really want to check if I can, like, do suppressors and stuff, but not right now. Or maybe I might do that at the end. Although, I really think... You know what? Maybe I'll just uh, leave this behind. I'm sorry about that, but... Uh, back here, and let's... Uh, Let's 
spawn another shorty. You know what? Make sure to take that safety off. Oh my goodness. That Let's put that on the... Uh... Yeah, that's nice. I like that. All right. Everything is good. Everything is set. Oh no, I'm out. <laughs> terrible, terrible. <sighs> Where did you come from? Whoa, hey now. This one's empty. It's wandering patrol just coming out of nowhere, you know? I'm trying to reload my weapons here. Whew. All right. Oops. Okay. All pretty good. Ah, oh, stuck. Oh no! Don't do that to me. Analyzing system. Where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? <laughs> well, that was fun. I really like this shotgun. Take that health. Whew. All right. Why the wrong face? What a jerk.
Oops. I mean to do that. Hit my headset. All right. Let's go to the hold point. <laughs> Ooh. Boom, boom. All right. <laughs> Whew. Oh, man. Is there anybody else over here? Good. Okay. I'm going to make sure everything is set. Nope. Nope. Just in case. And uh, I haven't used this yet, so. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Analyzing system. Two, two, one, two. Come on, where are you coming from? Behind. One from behind, one over here. Where are you coming from? Come on. Oh, gotcha. Where are these guys coming from? Over here. Come on. <laughs> nice. Shoot. Bam. Data extracted. All right. Override tokens found. Advance to next system node and take it. No, yeah, well, actually, let's go this way. Uh oh, I hear a patrol. Oh, goodness, <laughs> that scared me. Oof. Actually, hold on just a second. Let me move this up higher. And, uh... Oh, I thought that was like a flintlock or something. <laughs> I really love this shotgun. <laughs> this shotgun's really good. But, I mean, you know... You could say that about any, like, Semi, uh, semi-automatic shotgun. I don't know why. This one, I, you know, this one just clicks with me for some reason. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Ooh, oh. Oh. 
Goodness. Hate it when they do that. They just like stumble upon you, you know? Okay, we've got a uh huh? My goodness. Ooh, nice. Hey, a suppressor. Let's see if this uh this will work. Oh, nope, does not work on this shotgun. Let's try the uh, chop. Oh, okay. So that's one uh, disadvantage. You can't use the uh, suppressors on these things. Well, with the bore shark, you could. And I should try it on the um, pocket hammer. But I don't have one. And of course, I'll work on the uh, 1911. So <laughs> that's a kind of given. And I don't think it'll work on a revolver, but eh, whatever. All right. Hold point. It's right here. Better get ready. Let's go. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. <sighs> Whoops. What happened there? What's going on? Huh? No. <sighs> Why am I not going up on the platform? Am I not? No, that is so strange. Oh, well, that is just... Where are you? Where are you? Got it. Right? That's not going to work. I'm just going to go up here. Oh, my goodness. That is a bug that Anton needs to fix. That is just... That's not cool. Oh, goodness. Whew. Ladders are not working properly. Where are you? Come on. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh. Got a couple more of these guys somewhere. I don't know where they are. Oh, are you serious? Nope. Or advancing to next system layer. Swinger. Analyzing system. Next system node. Oh, <laughs> that's one thing uh, that is broken, I guess. The ladders don't work. Okay. <laughs> well, that's good to know. Hopefully I won't have to do any uh, ladders in the future.
Okay. You know, go back, go back, go back. Is that a health pickup? Come back. Come here. No. I got it. <laughs> Oh god, I missed. <laughs> uh. Oh. Gotcha. Oh no, I'm out of ammo. I better run. You're gonna need a wagon when I'm done with you. Gotcha. Boom. Boom. Oh, I missed. Boom. <laughs> oh man, that's fun. Need to reload. Didn't use that, did I? Nope. Okay, this is the, uh, okay, this is a supply point that I just, uh, unlocked, or, uh, taken, took. Oh, there's still a person over here. Gotcha. <laughs> Whoa, there's another one over there. Are you kidding me? Gotcha. All right, at least I cleared the uh, hold point. Huh. I hear some meat squeaking. Ooh. 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 Let me grab that health here. <laughs> it's like I don't really need it, but hey, you know. Since I've got like tons of health. Oh, nice. Twelve gauge, man. Twelve gauge just destroys sausages. But to be fair, these guys aren't wearing armor, so. Override token found. <sighs> hey, what is this? See what we get here. Ah, hey. Oops. It's a model 10, I presume. Not that I really need it, but it'd be nice to get a little bit of different uh weapon variety. I don't know where to put this. You know what? Auto, what, Model 8, sorry. Model 10. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Let's put that there. Uh, a grenade. A stick of dynamite. Oh, light, uh, match. All right, fine. I'll just take the dynamite with me. <laughs> All right. Well, we got one more old point. Let's use the Model 8. Oh, wait, hold on. Could I put the uh, suppressor on this thing? If I remember correctly, I think you could. There we go. Okay. Where is the center of my room? I need to find it. There we go. Ooh. Can I just try something for a minute? I really don't like the way matches work in this game. So I just want to see... Oh, I did it. Oh, I did it. I did do it. Where is that coming from? I hear meat slapping. Override took 
token found. Override token found. I hear slapping meat. Oh no! Not the right one. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> oh man. I knew that dynamite would have brought the uh, would have got their attention. Okay. Sure, this is topped off. This needs reloading. Okay, well. Oh, you know what? Since we've got all this stuff, let's grab ourselves a power up. And maybe another one. Ghost. Okay. We are full. Okay. Let's go take that hold point. <laughs> if I manage to beat this, then, uh, well, it's a pretty hollow victory, s considering that I have, like, infinite health. Oh, got it. And I'm using, like, a relatively modern shotgun, I, I mean, I, I would think. I think this is... Well, I actually don't know when the shotgun came out. I'd need to look it up online, but. I think it'd be after, like, um, maybe during World War One, World War Two, maybe. And these guys are all like, you know, cowboys and stuff. <laughs> so. All right. Get some high ground here. Analyzing system. Oh no. Where are you coming from? There you go. Over here. Check this out. Oh. Get closer. Popped his head. That's fine. That's fine. Get in there, please. Thank you. Analyzing system. Oh man, that is a lot of them. Seriously? Got it. <laughs> Come on.
God. Mr. Gatling gun over there. Uh, that was tough. Advance to next system node and take it. Return it to <laughs> All right, hold on just a second. I really need to figure out. There we go. All right, that's enough explosions. I actually want to try one more thing before I stop, but hold just a second. My cord is tangled up. There we go. I didn't do this. I don't know why I didn't do this, but um, I just want to check one thing. Let's go to the attachments. Let's grab one of these. Obviously, the, the suppressors don't work with the... Uh, but yeah, all right. That's pretty cool. All right, and yeah, it works with this, actually. Hmm. That, well, actually, yeah, no, it's fine. It just feels like the guns are a little further forward from where I usually think they are, but I just want to check. No. Hmm. Yeah, see, that is strange. Usually they're they're in line with where the trigger is, but well, you know, whatever. Maybe that's a thing that Anton decided to do. I'm not going to question it. It still felt good in my hands. Yeah, that's weird. Hmm. Yeah was okay you know but uh yeah that's about it for today i am exhausted I need to find out where my chair is this time i have to turn uh turn the lights on so i don't fall on my fall on my ass again <laughs> it was last week or uh i don't remember but uh yeah that was painful so yeah that's it for today um i'll see you guys next time